The STEM launch program is really a wonderful opportunity. It stands for science, technology, engineering, mathematics, and learning and understanding new career horizons. And we're really trying to give the participants in the program an opportunity to learn more about the opportunities that they have overseas in the STEM field. Now say our T's on three. <laughs> One, two, wow. three. Uh, the purpose of our trip is to learn more about Germany, to explore its uh, industrial university uh, opportunities, and maybe uh, hopefully our students will look for uh, educational training here and maybe future uh, professional careers. I'd never been abroad before, so coming to Europe, especially Germany, seemed very appealing to me. Um, I decided to come to the tour because, I've, first of all, I've never been to Germany and I thought it would be a great experience to go to Europe and be able to explore and then I know it's a lot of companies here and a lot of opportunities for STEM majors. All of them have had uh, academic research to this point and uh, we hope that uh, by their experiences here in Germany, they will begin to look at industrial opportunities as well. I'm a chemistry and mathematics double major at Morehouse College. I do a lot of theoretical chemistry and theoretical physics research. So coming here was really interesting because they do a lot of applied stuff. So it, was, it gave me the opportunity to see the other side of science. <laughs> Well, I hope to bring back a lot of information from these companies. I take a lot of notes. Um, being able to share with my uh, other colleagues and friends and peers about the different opportunities they have here um, and to let them know they can open up their eyes and um, explore the different opportunities here um, and tell my family about them um, and just be more educated on these different companies globally, um, especially in Germany, to know what they have to offer and be able to share that with um, everybody in America. Some of the students had some apprehensions about coming to the Germany and the language barrier, and I think they've found that there is not much of a language barrier in Germany. Are you thinking of learning German after this trip? Um, actually, yes, I am. I did learn a little bit of German, but my best friend's dad is German, and so he talks to us all the time in German. So, yes, I am I'm gonna learn more German. So, yeah. So when we put together the program, it was quite exciting because we have such a diverse group. So the program in Germany, the company visits also reflect that diversity. We had, for example, visiting BMW, Siemens, the Fraunhofer Institute, uh, Max Planck Institute for Biochemistry, um, the European um, Center for, of Aerospace and Aviation, the German Center for Aerospace and Aviation, um, the Federal um, Institute for Materials Research and Testing, um, as well as Technic Universities in Berlin and Munich. Um, and we really tried to to include both opportunities for industrial research and development and also um, university research and university related research for the group. I don't know if I heard this um, clearly, but five out of a hundred patients get to phase mm, get to phase three. Like, why is that? Why is it so low? We start with ten thousand molecules, right. and then I think three to five end molecules at the end, um, and then we go to the drug. Okay. So it's more to show it's very. Um, there are many opportunities. There are let's say many keys to open the door, and we are looking for the right One key. More. Um, to attach to the molecule and to solve a certain issue in the body. We really appreciate the high interest of the students in our company and also in our career opportunities. We also um, yeah, welcome all kind of um, different qualifications, people from different backgrounds, um, as we need um, diversity within our employees. I'm so excited and I was looking forward to this experience the whole time, so I'm so glad we finally made it here. And I'm definitely looking into having an experience as far as internship, um, probably next summer, because I graduate in May. So I'm looking forward to coming here straight after I graduate for about six months, um, like, you know, just to experience and get my own project, like um, Sonia was saying, you know, and go from there.
This is very exciting, very informational, and I look forward to finding out more information and applying for the internship. The dress code is, is business and casual. How does it feel? How was it for you to have to dress up every day? Um, to me, uh, I kind of like dressing up, especially going to these companies so um, they can have a good impression on me. And um, I don't mind it at all. I think it's actually good that we're dressing up because once we start our careers, this is going to be our d daily attire. I'm here today at the ZAV learning about facts and figures and the employment market here in Germany, as well as social security, employment rate, taxes, and many other things that would be helpful for me if I ever did decide to um, move here to Germany and work. Uh, hello, Mr. Rauhu. On behalf of Morehouse College and Spelman College, uh, we would like to present this token uh, to you okay. for all your services and uh, oh. presenting to us. So today. here's a card. Thank you. Thank and you here's a pen from the zoo of right. And here's nice. a robot to remember Ooh. that we came with the STEM oh. technology group. Excellent. Okay. Thanks very much. Yeah. Thank you. Wow. I was surprised when I in Deutschland gelandet and I I viel Spaß. The Speisen, die Leute, alles. Sehr gut.